Hi, my name is Joshua Lopez Gallo of Great Ten Rizal, and I will going to tackle all about computer system servicing, computer hardware quarter one performance task in TLE ten. So, what is the definition of computer hardware? Computer hardware is the physical parts or components of a computer, such as the monitor, mouse, keyboard, computer data storage, hard disk drive graphic cards, sound cards, memory, motherboard, and so on, all of which are physical objects that are tangible. So, quite simply, computer hardware is the physical components that a computer system requires to function. It encompasses everything with a circuit board that operates within a PC or laptop, including the motherboard, graphics card, CPU or central processing unit, ventilation fans, webcam, power supply, and so on. Here are the computer hardware parts. First is printer. A printer is a device that accepts text and graphic output from a computer and transfers the information to paper. Usually to standard size 8.5 degree I, inches by 11 inches sheets of paper. Printers, var printers vary in size, speed, sophistication, and cost. The best known non-impact printers are the inkjet printer and the laser printer. In computing, a printer is a peripheral machine which makes a persistent representation of uh, graphics or text uh, usually on paper while most output is human readable barcode printers are an example of an expanded use of four printers the different types of printers include the 3d printer inkjet printer laser printer thermal printer and the air printer next is computer data storage Computer data storage is a technology consisting of computer components and recording media <clears throat> that are used to retain digital data. It is a core function and fundamental component of computer. So the main purpose of this component is to store data. The central processing unit is then able to fetch and change the data. In most computers, there is a computer memory hierarchy memory that is closer to the CPU okay next part is the hard disk drive a hard disk drive hard disk hard drive or fixed disk is an electromechanical data storage device that stores and retrieves digital data using magnetic storage and one or more rigid rapidly rotating platters coated with magnetic material. The platters are paired with magnetic heads, usually arranged on a moving actuator arm, which read and write data to the platter surfaces. Data is accessed in a random access manner, meaning that individual blocks of data can be stored and retrieved in any order. HDDs are a type of non-volatile storage retaining stored data even when powered off. Modern HDDs are typically in the form of a small rectangular box. So this is hard disk drive. Next is graphic cards. A graphic card is an expansion card for your PC that is responsible for rendering images to the display. High-end GPUs are used for gaming, ray tracing, graphics production, and even mining cryptocurrency. A graphics card looks like a smaller version of the computer motherboard. It's a printed circuit board that has a processor, RAM, and other components. A graphic card is sometimes commonly referred to as a graphics processing unit or GPU, but in reality, the GPU is just a component of the graphics card. Next is motherboard. A motherboard in general uh, is uh, the main 
printed circuit board in general purpose computers and other expandable system. Motherboard means specifically a PCB with expansion capabilities. As the name suggests, this board is often referred to as the mother of all components attached to it, which often include peripherals, interface cards, and daughter boards, sound cards, video cards, network cards, host bus adapters, TV tuner cards, IEEE 1394 cards, and a variety of other custom components. Similarly, the term main board describes a device with a single board and no additional expansions or capability such as controlling boards in laser printers, television sets, washing machines, mobile phones, and other embedded systems with limited expansion abilities. Next is memory. Computer memory is a storage space in the computer where data is to be processed and instructions required for processing are stored. The memory is divided into a large number of small parts called cells. Each location or cell has a unique address which varies from 0 to memory size minus 1. Computer memory or random access memory is your system's short-term data storage. It stores the information your computer is actively using so that it can be accessed quickly. The more programs your system is running, the more memory you'll need. Okay? Next is sound card. A sound card is an internal expansion card that provides input and output of audio signals to and from a computer under control of computer programs. A sound card is one of the physical components of hardware that makes up your PC, turning digital code into sounds. Not just music, of course, but also the exploding gunfire from the latest video games to the latest cat video on YouTube you've seen, uh, you've been seen sending to all your friends. Okay. So this is how sound card works in a computer hardware. Next is monitor. A computer monitor is an output device that displays information in pictorial or text form. A monitor usually comprises a visual display, a casing, and a power supply. The display device in modern monitor is typically a thin film transistor liquid crystal display with LED backlighting having replaced cold cathode fluorescent lamp backlighting. Previous monitor used a cathode ray tube and some plasma displays. Monitors are connected to the computer via VGA, Digital Visual Interface, HDMI, Display Port, USB, Low Voltage Differential Signaling, or other proprietary connectors and signals. Next is Mouse. A mouse or a computer mouse is a handheld pointing device that detects two-dimensional motion relative to a surface. The mouse is a small movable device, movable device that lets you control a range of things on a computer. Most types of mouse have two buttons and some will have a wheel in between the buttons. Most types of mouse connect to the computer with cable and use the computer's power to work. Some types of mouse are also wireless. Next is keyboard. A computer keyboard is an input device used to enter characteristics or I mean characters and functions into the computer system by pressing buttons or keys. A keyboard is for putting information including letters, words and numbers into your computer. You press the individual buttons on the keyboard when you type. The number keys across the top of the keyboard are also found on the right of the keyboard. The letter keys are in the center of the keyboard. So this is how keyboard works. So this is all for now for, uh, for computer hardware. So I hope you learned a lot in this, from this video. Thank you so much and have a nice day.